independence and marketing the way i see it and there are two ways to respond to this question the first is as a function whether marketing is an independent function here i would say especially in bfsi uh, marketing cannot be an independent function because we have to work very closely with the business and product team to deliver the business objectives while marketing has the ability to kind of deliver across the marketing function right from uh, like across the funnel right from awareness to consideration to conversion and uh, uh, also referral and loyalty and all of that however if uh, marketing as a function works very very closely with business to achieve business objectives i mean uh, uh, it becomes a potential force i feel and uh, the the true value of marketing is realized uh, and we can kind of you know track uh, conversions and determine roi for every single thing that uh, uh, marketing does the other way the other is uh, way to look at this uh, question is whether there is independence in the function itself in the day to day scheme of things in in terms of the operational independence there yes i would say marketing uh, uh, should be independent to get the best out of it so uh, as we all know it's a very creative field and there is always new ways of doing things new ways of running campaigns new medium to tap into the tools to use uh, customer insights uh, and customer behavior constantly changing and we need to align to them and uh, all this uh, you know uh, the va value of a marketer is to you know uh, gather the right customer insights and you know create communication which is relevant uh, targeted and in the moment so that um, you know truly achieves uh, uh, the value when we get, uh, marketers get enough independence when there are too many processes to follow or there are a lot of levels of approvals uh, it kind of the creativity can get thwarted and as a result uh, we may land up with very you know straightforward um, uh, campaigns uh, which kind of deliver very direct messaging and the, it may lack creativity there are three e's to look out for or to uh, you know uh, harness uh, encouragement to the team empowerment to the team and to emphasize and reinforce uh, the way uh, the team thinks in marketing we need to constantly look at new ways of doing things and innovative ways of reaching audiences so that our campaigns are also memorable mm, uh, and uh, you know the team needs to be encouraged to this way of thinking to think out of the box to constantly experiment innovate uh, to constantly have a learning orientation to apply the learnings and uh, uh, we need to also have a learning culture within the organization for example there should be an innovation or experimentation budget where the team is allowed to experiment they are allowed to fail they are allowed to learn and move ahead uh, however experimentation is an ongoing process experimentation innovation and so on um also the team should be empowered uh, along with this uh, they should be empowered to take up uh, to decide to, to do their own independent decision making to decide on various elements of the campaign agency selection and so on uh, they should be uh, encouraged uh, and obviously this also means that empowerment always comes with responsibility it doesn't mean that uh, you know no questions asked Uh, of course so all the cam campaigns have to have uh, results evidence data driven uh, uh, you know tracking uh, roi mapping and so on so definitely uh, the outcome has to be tracked uh, the success or failure of the campaign has to be determined learnings gathered and then apply and go ahead uh, in the future and of course this innovative way of thinking uh, definitely needs to be rewarded Uh, when we reach when we achieve success uh, one of our recent campaigns unichar ka munya ladam which we did in in kerala in kochi where we had 101 swings created a world record uh, of sorts because of its innovation uh, innovative uh, concept so uh, uh, 
definitely um, you know team members need to be innovative and we need to create that environment as leaders marketing can create brands it can create desire it can determine customer insight and can track a customer journey right from a potential customer uh, across the uh, consumer leg to acquisition it can also enhance existing customer value uh, with for existing customers customers with the right communication and the right campaigns reaching at the right time with adequate amount of personalization and so on so these are some of the numerous strengths of marketing and actually any business objective and i'm saying business objective can be achieved through marketing across the marketing funnel through the host of media that we have at play right now and through the host of tools that we can use to uh, you know deliver that uh, coming to uh, weaknesses um, well there is an upfront investment that one has to take there is a cost to be incurred in everything that uh, a marketer does and so uh, uh, in a lot of cases it's viewed more like a cost center rather than an investment center um uh, marketing is also very vulnerable uh, to the you know changing very fast changing customer landscape uh, customer behavior regulatory norms and uh, we have to constantly align ourselves as marketers um to this uh, there is also uh, negative publicity that one has to uh, you know constantly endure and encounter through various uh, you know campaigns um and uh, yes the uh, you know data uh, data framework regulatory requirements that will constantly change so we have to adapt to that these are some of the weaknesses i would say coming to opportunities um again it's extremely interesting the times that we are in the current landscape uh, especially in digital marketing with a host of martech tools which kind of allow us to do uh, you know almost um, everything i mean we can really do personalization at scale and we can uh, you know reach uh, the right message to the right customer at the point of intent and that is the true you know value of martech as we call it uh, so there is a huge opportunity if we use the martech tools and stack interestingly of course in alignment with the business objectives um the advent of ai and ml uh, again creates a huge opportunity ahead uh, we can use predictive uh, uh, technology to you know create a lot of propensity based campaigns um for marketing we can integrate with our bots uh, and so on um uh, we can give the customer a great Uh, uh you know ui ux and customer experience across all our uh, digital platforms uh um so and and this constantly new media also evolving there's a lot of new age media there are a lot of new tools today there is oem and there are several way different ways also to reach customers so those are a host of opportunities available to us and lastly the threats um uh, well there are threats within there are threats uh, externally uh, a whole lot of uh, uh, agencies mushrooming small and big across sizes each one specialized that's uh, a threat uh, as well as an opportunity uh, if i may say um there's also a threat within where uh, you know everybody wants to be a marketer and everybody thinks they everybody has an opinion on marketing so uh, a lot of internal uh, departments also would like to play this role um and of course the constant onslaught of uh, competition that we face in our day to day lives so these are uh, some of the threats